A very good evening. My name is Alok Shivastava, and I welcome you once again to Network Nuts YouTube channel. So no background, no Eva Mendes, just pure technical stuff. So what's here? Here I'll just show you. It's a very small video, I hope. And in this video, I'll show you how to do a remote installation on a machine using Telnet. Means. Suppose it's my already installed machine as you can see there and I'm sitting here. No, it's not my picture. <laughs> it's a icon or whatever you want to say. And it is a new machine I want to get installed, a brand new machine. But because of any restrictions like might be there is uh, not ample space in my server room or I want to do some more tasks. I don't want to just sit here and complete the installation. What I want to do, I will just, I just want that I will just start the installation here via CD or DVD or the PXE and we'll just move out here and, I'll, and I will just come here and then I will complete rest of the installation from here means I'll just activate the, the, the normal installation and I will come here. So what, how can I do this? I can use the telnet command to take the whole interface of the installing machine on the already installed machine so how can i do this so it is a very good feature in case you are doing a text only installation okay don't panic in the next video i will show you the how to take remote uh, like uh, the console of a remote machine during installation using the gui also but in this video i will show you in case you are doing a text only installation so how can you use the telnet command to take the display on a different machine rather than sitting on the installing machine. So here I have got two, uh, two machines. I'll show you. I hope you will appreciate this beautiful picture out here. I just minimize this. I have my already installed machine. Here it is my already installed machine. It is running rel, rel 6, 6.2 and it is my machine which I will be using for the new installation. So I, I had just created a brand new machine rel 6 test remote. So I will just start it as it boot from the CD or the ISO here. What we normally do, we just press enter here normally. Don't press enter, press the tab here. I hope it is visible in the video and just write here Linux text telnet means I am activating the telnet service during the installation and I am running the installation in the text mode and then you are free to assign IP here also say I give IP is equal to 192.168.0.114 or any other IP that you wish to assign and write the mask also net mask is equal to 255.255.255.0 as I am using a class C IP address. So what I had done, I had just started the installation of a brand new machine and during at the time of we boot from the CD or the DVD or from the PXE, instead of pressing enter at the install or upgrade an existing machine, I had pressed tab and I had passed some boot parameters. I had, I had written here Linux text means I am installing in the text mode. I am activating the telnet service and the IP is is this which I am assigning at the time of the booting only. So I just press enter here and just wait. You will see something here. Uh, right now I cannot do telnet from my uh, 6.2 machine. I have to wait. The anaconda will prompt me. See it's a very beautiful feature when you want to control the installation or do the, the installation from a different machine just go to the base machine or the brand new machine just start the installation and come back to your seat. That's it. Now it, the IP is being assigned waiting for the here it is waiting for telnet connection. Now I can just go here and give telnet and the IP address of the new machine 114 is the IP address. Hua, look here it is. Now you, you can see here running Anaconda via Telnet. Now I can do I can do all the things from here. I need not to be there on the new machine. I'll, okay, I'll do a skip here. I'm not going to show you the full installation, the, like the whole installation. 
I'll just show you. I do a skip here. It will check the hard disk and other things. Now look, I am on a different machine, and but I am I'm at the machine named as instructor, and I'm doing the installation or controlling the installation of a different machine. That is the beauty. Just a moment. Here it is. Just wait. So it can be very handy or a very useful tool when you want to uh, don't want to leave the comfort of your chair, haha, <laughs> and just do all the things from your chair only. So just go there. Use the telnet command and enjoy the things. Enjoy the network. Enjoy the Linux and enjoy the videos from Network Nuts. I hope you like it. You you are liking the videos. Just wait. I'm not ending the video right now because as it is normally the last sentence or the phrase I say. Just wait. I'll just show you. It takes some time. Here it is. So whether you want to start the VNC or text mode. Right now I am just using the text mode. So I press on text mode. And guys, welcome to Red Hat Enterprise Linux and rest is history. You know what to do. That's great. So I hope you like the concept of taking the control or doing the installation from a different machine on a brand new machine over the network. That's great. So I'm not doing it. I'm just like uh, it is my hard disk of 8 GB. So I'm just stopping the video right here. I, I hope you got the point. I'll just show my picture once again here it is the blue machine was the this machine the blue one and the red the red one is this one so i'm controlling it i'm controlling the left hand side from the right hand side and it is using the telnet for the remote installation in case of a text only in, uh, uh, like installation in the next video i'm going to show you how to do the same things for a graphical installation so i hope you like the video oh i don't want to save it i cancel it i minimize it so i can do rest of the like installation from here i need not to be there on the physical or the brand new machine so that is how you can do the things i hope you like the video thank you very much it's a very small tool but can be very useful thank you very much once again, see you soon. God bless. Take care. Bye. Stop the video now. Hoo-ha.